Can you guys see the clouds just touching above? This place is kind of pretty. I don't know why, but it's always easier going up these little shitty roads than it is to go down. I've seen quite a lot of farmers, like old grannies, planting stuff everywhere in the little niches around the house. There are a lot of people living here, quite surprised. And I saw the biggest snake, <laughs> actually probably the first snake that I've seen in the wild. But unfortunately I didn't have the GoPro battery attached and I, you know, I stopped the bike and I jumped off. I tried to take a picture but I wasn't quick enough and I didn't want to run after it in the grass trying to look for it. That would have been pretty stupid. But yeah, first snake. And I don't even have footage, so... <laughs> you can believe me or not. Yeah, it's gonna take forever to get down here. There's another treasure. Whoa! I hope I can get over that hump again. Yeah, I have a I have a thing for these old shitty cars. Unfortunately. Yeah, I'm gonna do a. I'm gonna do like a collection video of all those abandoned cars in a while. Well, in sinks. It comes with spare tires. You know that last little, that last little millimeter here, that last fucking half centimeter. Can you guys see the car up there? I just came around this bend and I saw that car up there. And I'm going to put all the cars that I find today, but I've never found two cars and a scooter in the same day before. I'm going to put these in the video. Well, because I found them today, but I'm going to make another video, like some kind of compilation of all kinds of abandoned vehicles. I'm sorry that I, it's a bit shaky because I only have the helmet today. I didn't bring a gyro or anything. I just parked the bike over there. This is funny. Let's give you guys a closer look. It's a shame that this stuff doesn't run anymore. <laughs> wow. There's a wheelbarrow in there. And one, one big ass hornet or whatever that is. Wow. I think this stuff is strangely beautiful. Let's try another angle. Sorry about the breathing. What a, <laughs> what a thing to do. Let's just drive to the mountain and dump the damn thing. And make sure to put the wheelbarrow on there. No, but I think I've seen this a lot of times when people, you know, people have been in the car and then like locals just dump shit in it because they also want to 
damp garbage, but you know they don't just want to throw it over the side. So like it's like kind of like cleaning up or something. And I can see the next treasure right over there. Wow! Oh, there's two. Look at that. Let's park. <laughs> the TV. Just look at all the dirt. Yeah, I've said it before. Whoopa. What do you guys think about this? I mean, it's shit that they litter, basically. You've, <laughs> you've thrown a car. You've irresponsibly disposed of a car. Does that count as littering? I usually don't touch this stuff. I usually try to keep it as it is, but I just can't help myself at the moment. How did they do that? They didn't slide down from up there. How did they? How did they dispose of the stuff here, like this? That's. <laughs> it's locked. Wow. This is great. But I think it is great. Look at all this rock. St slowly starting to get buried. Okay, you guys, get, you guys are getting a bonus because I did not see this beauty when I came up here. So I'm just on my way down. <laughs> People, seriously. I have never found so many in one single day. This is pretty. Shrine, grave, I don't know. I don't know, how old is this thing? Any car guys here? This is probably the oldest one that I saw. Or oh, I want to say found today. If there are any car guys, you can tell me what this is, because I have no clue. Sorry about the shaky video. You know, one indicator usually, I don't know, I don't know about your country, but the vehicle inspection sticker in Germany is on the license plate. In Japan, the vehicle inspection sticker is here, where that spider is. So that's already gone. So we can't even see that. 50 years? <laughs> I've got no idea.